people ask all the time about creating passive income and there's a lot of myths because that is a very, very buzzword right now. To create quote unquote passive income, the, the definition of passive income is, is passive income is money that you already have that's working for you. Okay, so my money is working for me. You need to have excess active income. What is active income? Active income is me going to work, getting a paycheck, taking the paycheck, and then paying all my bills, doing all my whatever, and then anything extra, I can take that money and then put it into something else and that money will work. But you gotta have excess in order to make anything passive. So if you're living check to check, you're not gonna have passive income. You're just not, okay? You have to have money left over from the active income in order to make that work. People think, and they always say passive, it, it, very, very little money is passive income, okay? How do you get passive income? You take that extra income and you find something you like, something you wanna learn about, something you want and invest there. Meaning, for example, I'll give you some examples of how I make passive income. I give money to house flippers and let them use that money and they pay me a larger than normal percentage on that money because they don't wanna to go to a bank. So instead of paying 7% at the bank right now, they pay me 12 or 15%. So I give him X number of dollars, for example. So okay, we got $75,000, he's gonna pay me 15% of that money and he's gonna give me my return in six months. That's pretty good, okay? That's another way. Another way is like what they call syndications, where you take a, a dollar amount, put it into a big group, and then they promise to give you what they call a draw, like, you know, give them 20 grand, and then they're gonna give you $1,000 a month for the next two years, and then give you some more it's it's a syndication where you put it in and you depend on the big conglomerate to make money and they give you small returns on that not a bad thing i got buddies that do it owning a business buying a business taking your excess money and buying a business that kind of runs itself meaning you go buy a laundromat you put an operator in place have them operate you pay them but then their the money that the business makes comes back to you that is a great way of of making passive income rentals buying a house for $200,000, the mortgage is $1,000 a month, you charge $2,000 a month, you have your bills and things like that, you make six or $700 a month. That is a passive income stream. But again, you gotta have money to, to invest in that. Um, I got a buddy in town that does Turo, where he, he has a bunch of cars that he's bought on credit, and then he rents them out and he ends up making a profit. That's not super passive, but if you have someone run that for you, it could be passive. Very, very little income is passive because most of it takes you managing it to make that money work. It's out there, but typically passive income is for money that you've got a large amount of money that's going to work for you. Is it possible? Yes. Is it take a while? It certainly is.